started? Uh, well, I think... So it's uh, too early. Yeah, <laughs> it, it, it's too early. So right now it's about RRR. So I would like to stick to talk about RRR. And yes, as you mentioned, that's going to be my next film. But in the coming days, I'm going to give you all the details. About Ram Chiran walks away with all the accolades. What do you have to say? No, ma'am, I don't believe that at all. Not even for a second. Uh, I think we both have excelled uh, beautifully and Tarak was fantastic. I don't think I've enjoyed uh, working in a film, in any other film but RRR. And what I'll take back from RRR is my journey with Beam, my journey with Tarak. I shall never ever forget. Thank you Raj Maligaru for giving me that opportunity. I love him to bits and it will always remain the same. Uh, Rajamali sir to your right. Hi. Uh, Rajamali sir, uh, all the accolades, all the appreciation, everything that the movie is getting, it deserves that and so much more. So congratulations to the entire team for that. But uh, my question is also, Baobali 2 uh, makes 1800 crores globally. Now RRR makes 1000 crores uh, globally. So when you achieve these summits and when you are making a movie, it almost feels like you are scaling a new summit every time. So when you are going to make the next movie, is even though as an artist you are concentrating creatively, is this also a mountain of expectations in the third movie that it cannot come below these benchmarks that you have set for yourself? Uh, well, uh, let me uh, try to put it this way. Uh, I always said that uh, what we can do is give our 100% to the project and make it in the best possible way that it can be made. The numbers are not in our hands. That is the love and appreciation from the audience. That can be uh, uh, affected by many factors. 